Well, hello there, everyone. I'm Darth Bramlett, and welcome to the next part of my South Park Fractured But Whole playthrough. In the previous video, we infiltrated the um, Freedom Friends. Um, we'll do that later. Here comes the new kid. Oh yeah, we um, got Tweak and Craig back together as well, which is pretty cool. Go Freedom Pals! Let's go escape some crazy OABs. Yeah, we gotta go. Run, run, run. Oh. Quite a random cameo. Yay, we finally escaped. Hey, Mysterio. Yeah, we don't want to jeopardize anything. I'm not going to see Cartman just yet. No, I want to see Mrs. Cartman first. Oh my goodness. Time to pin things up a little bit. You've got to lay that slap on these women to show them who's boss. Yeah, you be a bad girl. Oh, all right. I'll join the family. You about to be a bitch's bitch. Yeah. Let's go for double trouble. Yeah, fuck you too. Yeah, you just got bitch slapped. Yeah, I'm 
I'm one hell of him. Random. Right, let's go and um, see Cartman. To infiltrate the police. We have to help her, fellas. We made a promise. If we let Freedom Pals go do this on their own, then we're the douchebag franchise they say we are. But why would Freedom Pals work with us? Don't forget the new kid is all buddy buddy with Freedom Pals now. Bloodlord can trick them into an assault on the lower level of the police station, and meanwhile we'll sneak in and bust Classy out. You're probably gonna get the Freedom Pals killed. And then, whose superhero franchise would be number one? Exactly. Devious Cartman. Everyone get home and get to bed. We have a big job to do tonight. Not time. You know how hard it is to look mysterious when you're just standing around in some kid's front yard? <laughs> Pretty fucking hard. I'm glad you're with us, new kid. It's been tough being the only one on the team with real superpowers. While all the other kids are playing and working on their franchise plans, I'm stuck defending the city against evil, with barely any time to work on my pitch for a Mysterion spin-off movie. Sometimes it feels like a curse having these powers. You know how it is, because you're like me. I'm sure the power of your ass weighs heavy on you. That it does. You don't know it. All these insane adults. Once we should put our petty differences aside and work together. All right, Mysterion, what's the plan? I think some of us should cause a diversion. Make the cops head towards it so the rest of us can sneak in without the cops noticing. Good idea. Good news will go to fire escape and cause the diversion so Freedom Pals can sneak in the front. This is all pretty coincidental. Did you guys just steal our lead again? Innocent people are being arrested, Toolshed. That's all that matters to us. It should be all that matters to you. Okay, cool friends at the fire escape. Come on, guys. That's enough. Just stand down, kid. Now we're not going to. Look, I know why you're here. You're fed up. Because you think all cops do is harass black people. I know that to a young kid it can seem like cops are racist and bigoted. But you can't believe what the media tells you. Cops are just people. Like you, your friends, your family. People who work hard to- Spook! Damn it, Levinsky, get your ass upstairs, sir! <laughs> Turn on the alarm! Oh, brilliant. That was, those cops are just comical. Let's go, Wonder Freedom Pals. Yeah, what's up with all these prisoners? Hey, you're the one who got me put in here. Oh, hey, kiddo, you're probably wondering why we're in here. Hey, you're that little well, asshole that got me in here. From the school where she can find our crowd. Okay, damn right. Ah. 
Good old uh, Mysterion. Might well get him on this side. I know. But yeah, kick him in the bars. Yeah. Yeah, my victory. Boom. Yeah, a little bit. Just go around arresting black people for no reason? What purpose could that possibly serve? It's reverse discrimination, that's what it is. <laughs> if we were all black cops and our jails were filled with white people, nobody would say a word. So I guess you've learned that the real bigots here are you. Huh, kids? Guess you can all go home. No? Fuck. Yeah, we ain't getting anywhere. Oh, hey, little dude. Do things seem really weird around here? A little bit. Supreme Court, here we come. Token, what did I tell you about playing too rough? Mom, I was defending justice. I don't care what you were defending. You could have gotten hurt. But Tupperware can't get hurt. He's impervious to pain. Is he impervious to getting his butt spanked? No. That's right. Oh, Token's in trouble. Is new kid. Something that's cheesy. Robot is told not to think for herself. It's the politicians who are the real bigots. That mayor has been sitting in her office telling us we have to change our ways. The only way to have her removed was to raise crime in the streets. And now cops are finally able to do things the old way again. Don't you see this is better for everyone? Holy shit, that scramble! The cat's been found. I say you kids have me by the balls. A little bit. Not every prisoner we have here is black. We actually do have one white guy. And who's that? This is a trap. I'm sorry, kids, but you left me no choice. He's still looking good. <laughs> With Sandy Cheese. His name is Jared, and he's still looking good. Uh. My goodness! Hey kids, want some candy? <laughs> oh fuck, it's Jared. You'll excuse me if I don't want to watch this. Oh my god, this is bizarre. I just love conjugal visits. I bet you do, you nonce. Kids, you want some candy? Of all the boss fights they could have. This is probably the most bizarre, uh, most... You're up to bat, new kid. How shall I put it? Near the knuckle. Uh, Bunglord's really giving him shit. How'd you kids like to see my famous footlong? <laughs> His famous footlong! Oh my god, I'm not going to be able to beat this guy because I'm going to be too busy laughing. Yeah, we won. Oh, you leveled up in the process. That was a hard part of that as well. What are the police doing with the people they arrested? Oh, how should I know? I'm just a sandwich guy. <laughs> yeah. Fart in his face. Oh, damn right we'll fart in your face. I'll tell you anything. What is the police chief hiding? There's, there's more cells down below. Cops take that elevator. Prisoners go down there, but they don't come back. What's the code? Oh, come on, how should I know, huh? Ah, ah. Yeah, yeah, I've seen him type it in. One, four, seven, seven. Please, I'm sorry. It's just that I like being with children, you know? <laughs> because I never had a childhood of my own. Yeah, that's it. I like kids because I never had a childhood. It's your decision, new kid. Part of being a superhero is deciding what to do in moments like these. I feel like I'm going to his face. Hardcore. All right, 
well, that was pretty uncomfortable. I know being a vector for disease is kind of my thing, but I, I feel kind of dirty. I don't. Do anything with the body? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, Chef Nigarat. Black goat of the woods. Blessed be us, your faithful servants, the destroyers of light. Yeah, yeah, Chef Nigarat. Black goat of one thousand morbid young. Draw down the moon and extinguish the sun. I am go. No! Okay. Oh, I see. I guess because cops feed African Americans to an elder god, they're racist. Not pretty much. Is an outer god, kids, who must be appeased and whose coming was foretold by the great H.P. Lovecraft. But I suppose H.P. Lovecraft was a racist too. Oh fuck! Was he really? Like, like how really? Really, really? Yo, this is my homeboy. Give me the fuck up. Let's end it! Alright, you kids want to battle? Let's do this. You guys get cheesy. This is messed up. We have to save them. Okay, chuck another one in. Oh, fucking hell no! Ha! <laughs> Okay, that's step time for us and evil. Get this coming, better run. The old. I think I know what we gotta do. You're going down. Appreciate the extra hand, new kid. Let's do this. Later in the battle. This, uh, that cult skin will not um, take you down that easily. Yes, we finally got him. Huzzah! Oh, a trophy as well. Even better. Footprints. We did it. We got the scrambles. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, the scrambles. Finally, after all that. Hooray! Whoa, whoa, wait! What's going on? Where are you taking that cat? Oh, uh, yeah, sorry, Freedom Pals. There's a certain intel we have that we can't share with you. You know, it's classified. That's because we've been tricked. The new kid plays at Freedom Pals. He did. What? Yeah, the new kid kind of totally fucked you guys over. Sorry. They followed our lead to the police station and now intend to get a hundred dollar reward for that missing cat. Well, all is fair in love and war, Freedom Pussy. <laughs> I love you, cut, Freedom. You assholes! We're the ones that stopped the police chief's evil plan. We deserve that hundred dollar reward. Oh yeah? Just try to take it from us. Fight, fight, fight. Civil War Three. That's it, new kid. We're gonna rip you apart. No, Mysterion. We won't fight the new kid. They will. Da da da. Okay, let's go. Okay, 
I better call in some reinforcements. Damn it. Now go tell everyone you cut yourself manscaping. Nah, no, sorry. Ha! Yes, but it's keep digging yourself in that hole. You're not gonna know what to do, but it was definitely the king. We got this. Huzzah! Whoa, what the... what happened? How'd my lip get busted? Where the fuck did Classy go? Dr. Timothy! You fucking animal! He was trying to help us! Dude, Mysterio is pissed at you, you kid. You guys started this war, not! You don't fucking understand! Dr. Timothy was working on a way to save all of us! Freedom Pals and Poon Friends! What? Oh. Uh -huh. Easy, Doc. You've taken a lot of this. Well, this is your guys' base. This is fantastic. This looks like so much fun. Yeah, I mean, Kool has a lot of cool stuff, too. But yeah, this is cute. Dr. Timothy was never your enemy. He was trying to help us all. But how? <laughs> now things are taking a good turn. He figured it out. It was Dr. Timothy's path. He worked tirelessly. A franchise plan that involved everyone. Each year, we had their own movie and TV series. Every year, we had equal to the other. Jesus. This is incredible. Timothy almost worked himself to death trying to come up with it. So while we were out trying to stick it to you guys, Timmy was actually trying to include us. Yeah. And then this kid nearly killed him. We're sorry the new kid is an asshole. That isn't our fault. Yeah, we were just using you guys. There's a hundred dollar reward for this cat. And you want to hurt to yourselves. Yeah, but not anymore. If we proved anything tonight, it's that we are the best when we are all together. It's too late for that. We all started as one team. We all wanted to be superheroes for the same reason. To sell our franchise and make millions of dollars. Let's be one team again. I agree. Come on, guys. No more civil war. Let's get the reward money for this cat and use it together for one franchise. Yeah. Let's do it. But we're calling it Freedom Pals. Freedom House. And so, like, Timmy is sort of the leader of Freedom House? <laughs> yes. Well, I think it's awesome. Honestly, Freedom House is a way better name than Coon and Friends. Freedom House. Freedom House. I'm super cool with this. And it's simple. Tomorrow, we get the reward money for Scrambles, and we use it to kickstart Timmy's franchise plan. Together. Definitely. House, retribution. But yeah, you guys, let's do this. Oh, you're damn right. And that is where it's ending for today's video. This has been Darth Browner. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to hit us a like and subscribe. And see you on the next video. Ciao for now.